Hi, this is Elizabeth Jones. Welcome to IDL 7140 LMS and Evaluations. We are in week six of a series of how to customize our nav bar and customize our homepage in D2L Brightspace. And right now we're looking at how to customize a nav bar specifically in D2L. We're gonna start with how to make manual customizations. So we will come over to the far corner and either hover our cursor over there. You may have to click it in that area for the ellipsis button to appear, but we're gonna select that ellipsis button and select edit this nav bar. Now you can delete links by selecting the X next to them, as you can see here as they highlight, or you can move links. I'm going to select those eight dots and just move it after the assessments. And so that is how you can move them. Now to uh, add links, you will come down here to the add links and select it and you can add any links that you want. Say, you know, we want to add a class list. If that's not already in there, we'll go ahead and select that and hit add. And then you will see, well, we did have it in there. Well, so that's a good way to show. We'll go ahead and select remove class list because we duplicated it. But now you know how to add the links and you can see that it's easy to remove them as well. Now to change the theme, you can uh, select the change theme option right here. And to, to select them, you'll just come and select one of these radio buttons. We can scroll through and see what's available and say you want to choose this one. We'll select it, select update, and then the theme will be updated. Um, and furthermore, we can change the title in the nav bar if we want to do that. We can use the, the org unit name or you can create a custom name. But once you're all done, you will go ahead and hit save and close. Now, if you want to use a nav bar template that is already created, you can go back to course admin at the top and you can select navigation and themes in the site setup section again. Now make sure that the nav bars tab is selected at the top here, and then you can look through the, the template options and select the drop down arrow next to them to see previews of each template. So we'll look at this course nav bar select preview and then we can see that that's how this one looks and we'll hit close after you're done if you want to make any changes you will go ahead and come up to the active nav bar select whichever one of the templates that you want to utilize and then you will you'll select it and then you'll hit apply and that template will be added you can also use the themes add or tab right here at the top you see um, to change the theme and you can do custom links as well. I just wanted to let you know that so those were available. And that is how to customize a nav bar in D2L Brightspace. I hope this tutorial was helpful and that you will join me for some more tutorials. Take care. We'll see you next time.